Hey guys, welcome to Edusection. In this video, we solve the remaining question of commerce. Question number 8a. Write short notes on number 1 Bhopal gas tragedy. This is very easy. You can answer this with your own words. Okay, I will explain you what it is. Bhopal gas tragedy, also called Bhopal disaster, was a gas leak incident in Bhopal, Madhya Pradesh. It occurred on the night of 2nd December 1984 at the Union Carbide factory. The chemical leaked was methyl isocyanate. Over 6 lakh people was exposed to this toxic gas which resulted in the death of around 15,000 people and leftover were harmed. Now number 2. Chernobyl disaster. This was a radioactive disaster at the Chernobyl nuclear plant located in Ukraine. This occurred on 26th April 1986. It is considered to be the worst nuclear disaster in the history of mankind. Large area of Ukraine and Russia were badly affected. More than 9000 people dead and over 6.5 million affected. Whole city of Chernobyl is still abandoned. Number B. Describe the role of the sales promotion and publicity in promoting a brand. So we start with the sale promotion. These are the short term incentives to promote the sale of the brand. It induces buyers to purchase a brand through various incentives like discount coupons, money refunds. It provides the buyer incentives to purchase the brand now, immediately and without any delay. Okay, now publicity. Publicity is very important for any brand. It allows free promotion of the brand. A brand can get good publicity by good public relation. That means quick service for complaint, taking suggestions and etc. Publicity can also be gained by public service. Ok now number C. Explain persuasion as an element of public relation and mention any two principles of persuasion. Ok let me first tell you what persuasion is. It means to convince a person to do something. Why it is important in public relation? It is important for product selling and service as it induces a person or a group to do something. Now the two principles of persuasion are number 1. Reciprocation. It is very important for persuasion. A suggestion is more likely to be accepted if it matches the desire of the person and that requires proper reciprocation. Now number 2 is conclusion. Stating a conclusion properly rather than leaving the people to draw their own conclusion is very important. Ok now question number 9 and 10 is case study. Now here is a case study. In case study you have to go through the passage and analyze it to find the hint for the question given below. Now I will directly start with the question. Ok number A is Name and discuss the price strategy used by Patanjali Ayurvedic Limited. Why has this strategy been successful? Ok, it is penetrating pricing. In this type of pricing, the price of the product is kept low at the initial stage. So the brand become popular quickly. I hope you have seen the advertisement of Patanjali where Patanjali compares its product with other branded products. So it helps the Patanjali to gain the market. So number B, Patanjali's target is to double their sale in the current financial year. How do they plan to achieve in this? Ok, I am giving you the answer in points. Number 1, retail outlets to increase the sale at many places. Number 2, tie up with retail chain to gain the urban market. Number 3, aggressive pricing or penetrating pricing. Number 4, Great deal of advertisement. I hope you have seen Ramdev Baba's on TV. And number 5, the online marketing. Number C, Patanjali has not been using sales promotion technique in increasing their sales. Discuss any 5 such techniques that you feel would help the company achieving its sales target. So the 5 points I am going to tell you are number 1, coupon. Number 2, premium offer. Number 3, discount offer number 4 exhibitions and number 5 festive sales. So this is the second case study. Question number 10. We directly move to the question. Number A. Name the key function of human resource management which Mr. Raj is expected to perform and mention the keys activity under this function. So the function name is procurement function 
it concerned with securing and employing the right kind and proper number of people required to accomplish the organizational objective that is the expansion in this case study so the keys under these functions are human resource planning recruitment selection placement and job analyzation number b describe any two role of human resource management so the two roles of human resource management are number 1 significance for an enterprise human resource management can help an enterprise in achieving its goals more effectively by attending and retaining the required talent through effective human resources planning recruitment selection placement orientation compensation and promotional policy now number 2 is the social significance sound human resource management has a great significance for the society it helps to enhance the dignity of the labor in the following ways providing suitable employment that provides social and psychological satisfaction to people maintaining a balance between the job available and the job seeker in terms of number qualification needs and aptitude now number c briefly explain any five tests required for selecting employees so the five points are applicant test a starting phase test like aptitude test number 2 employment test test based on work behavior like gd number 3 selection interview and interview with the hr manager to judge the personality and the skill face to face number 4 medical examination important phase to know about the health and number 5 final approval the candidate receive the offer letter and is approved for the job thank you for watching this video until the next video this is edusception signing off